Welcome to East Coast Elk Reviews today. We're reviewing. This is Greater Good Pulp Daddy. This is a juicy, hazy New England IPA. It says Nectar of the Hop Gods. This is uh, America's first all Imperial Brewing Company. It says Citrus Forward with a smooth mouth, uh, mouthfeel. This pulp variation cranks up the haze. Pulp Daddy. This remarkable blue beverage is brewed by Greater Good Imperial Brewing Co. Visit our pub brewery for live music, food, games, full draft lineup and tours at 55 Millbrook Street, Worcester, Mass. Brew to can in Worcester, Mass. If you want to check them out a little bit more, you can go to greatergoodimperials.com. Uh, unfiltered, some sediment is normal. Uh, nectar of the Hop Gods. Canned on 9-15-21. So this is a little bit older than three months. Um, so still fresh, should be still fresh. Um, I got Beer Advocate pulled up here. Score on Beer Advocate 93 for Outstanding Style IPA, New England. ABV 8% from Greater Good Imperial Brewing Company out of Massachusetts, United States. Status active notes. Um, pulp Daddy is an award winning 8% ABV New England IPA created as an extension of the popular pulp, Paul's Ultimate Lupulin Protocol. Like pulp, this juice forward IPA has a predominant citrusy aroma and tastes like nectar of the hop gods. We made one modification to the base process for pulp with a single objective in mind, dial up the haze. Objective accomplished. Pulp Daddy is easy drinking and refreshing with perfect nebulosity and mouthfeel. So I got my IPA glass. We're gonna crack this open. Um, the only other beer that I actually have had this before, I believe I had this on uh, the new beer with uh, Bumpy Road Brewery. But the only other beer that I've had by them is that gingerbread ale. So I've only had two beers by these guys. Both of them were decent. Um, this one, I, I enjoyed this one, but not like I said, doing more in-depth review. Um, the the uh, gingerbread ale was okay. It didn't really taste like a gingerbread cookie as much as I wanted it to. But uh, yeah, let's crack this open and uh, go for the pour, check out the appearance. Easy orange color, off-white head. Nice color to it. It's not extremely hazy, but it's got some nice haze. Um, actually, it is pretty hazy. Looks pretty good. Ooh, I can smell it from here. Let's check out the aroma on this one, guys. Lots of tropical fruit. Pineapple, peach, mango, lots of citrus as well. Orange, lemon, even some grapefruit, white bread, nice floral hoppiness. Sweet malt. Yeah, this smells really good. I think it's had a lot of tropical fruit on the nose. For the most part, I'm getting like pineapple and peach. It smells really good. Let's go for a taste. That's good. Lots of tropical flavor up front. Big dominant flavor to me is the peach. A little bit of a grapefruit, like uh, some floral hoppy, uh, hop resin on the finish. Tangerine, yeah, pineapple, peach, mango, some sweet caramel malt, nice breadiness, carbonations about medium, about medium body, medium mouthfeel. Ooh, very juicy. It's like pineapple and peach juice. What the heck was that? <laughs> that was a giant chunk. That was a really big chunk. I don't know if you guys have seen that. But uh, yeah, that was a lot of sediment. Yeah, this is really good though. Super tropical. Even a nice citrusy backbone to it. Well, there's a there's all the sediment. 
pouring like gray. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's a lot of sediment. Look at these chunks. I know you guys can see that. Holy crap, huh? That's a lot of sediment. I did not get as much sediment in, in the other can that I did this one. But yeah, very tropical up front. Nice citrusy uh, taste as well. Uh, decent amount of caramel ball adds to that sweetness, breadiness. Yeah, pineapple, peach, mango, tangerine. Even like a little bit of like a tart, lime, grapefruit. Very good. And the best part about it is you would not be able to tell that this was 8%. If somebody just handed this to me, I would think that this was like a six and a half, very juicy um, New England IPA. I would not think that it was 8%, no booziness at all. These are actually pretty dangerous because these are very crushable for what they are. Um, they do have like that nice, rich, juicy, mouthfeel body to it. But as far as ABV and booziness, no AB, no no booziness at all with this. Uh, for rating, I don't know what I, I don't remember what I rated it on Bumpy's channel. I'll give it like a 97. 97, I think so, yeah, because the price was a little bit up there. I think it was like 16.50 maybe. 16.50 maybe 17 dollars so it is a little pricey uh, but it's totally worth it availability if they have the greater good beers you should be able to find this one i believe this one might be their most popular one it actually has a lot of awards uh, um if you go on their website you can look at it it shows you what uh what awards it's won um but yeah this is a really good beer like i said 97 out of 100 if you guys like ipas or if you like new england ipas and uh for the most part, if you like New England IPAs, super juicy, tropical, flavorful um, IPAs with little bitterness because also Cyclops scale, I'd say this, it does have that caramel malt sweetness. So it's like, <clears throat> I'd say it's pretty sweet. Three and a half and a five sugar cubes and like two and a half going towards three hop cones, um, the juicy tropical citrus uh, flavors with this beer definitely cover up those hops and it's more like you're just drinking juice um, but yeah if you guys like a really juicy New England IPA I recommend trying this and uh, yeah I'm excited to try more beers by these guys um, I'd like to try a lot more of their IPAs they do have a lot of New England's I was looking on their website if you go check out their website they do do a lot of New England IPAs so I'm excited for that because New England IPAs are one of my favorite beer styles. And uh, yeah, there you have it. If there's anything else that you guys like to see on my channel, leave a comment down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more cool videos. Like your beer. Thanks for watching, guys. Cheers.